use the graph of f of x to estimate the following. For what x values is this curve increasing and decreasing? Write your answers using inequalities. So increasing and decreasing, as we move from left to right, what is happening to the curve? So, as I start from the left, the curve is increasing until it reaches this point, and then it decreases. So when we're talking about for the x values, you've got to remember to answer in terms of the x values. It was increasing, and using an inequality, it was increasing to the left. So if I sort of put a boundary here, here is where it was increasing, and then to the right of that boundary is where it was decreasing. So it was increasing where x was less than 2, decreasing where x is greater than 2. The vertex is the highest or lowest point on the parabola. In this case, that's our vertex. The vertex is an ordered pair. So the vertex is the ordered pair 2, 6. X-intercepts. The x-intercepts are the points where the curve cross the x-axis. So there's one and there's another. It does, it does say to estimate. So I'm going to say it's about negative 0.5 comma 0 and 4.5 comma 0. X-intercepts are ordered pairs. y-intercept. The y-intercept is the point on the curve there where the curve crosses the y-axis. So there's the y-intercept. That's an ordered pair, 0, 2. f of 3. We did these back in chapter 1, I think. When the input is 3, determine the output. When the input is 3, the output looks to be about 5. So I would say that f of 3 is equal to 5. What value or values will make f of x equal to negative 10? Where is the output negative 10? This point and this point. So there are two x values that make that y value negative 10. At negative 2 and at positive 6.